So I was shooting the PMC X-Tac match and the Federal Gold Medal match ammo. Um, started with the PMC X-Tac. I had 10 rounds in a partial box, so I decided to do two five-shot groups with it. So you can see here, printed probably a little over a two-inch group, or right at about two inches, 100 yards. Nothing too special. Um, had a decent little group in the middle, and then these two shots that went a little outside of the white circle there. Not horrible, but not the best. Um, second group at 100 yards, again five shots. All of them were in, or mostly in, the white circle with a couple that were just outside, around the edge, I mean. Um, again, probably around a two inch group there. Nothing too fancy, but uh, not too bad either. Switching over to the Federal Gold Medal match, as you can see, the trajectory changed a bit compared to the x -Tac match. The first round struck way down here, which is about two inches low which makes sense because the X-Tac match ammo is ballistically different than the gold medal match so I was kind of anticipating that would happen so then I adjusted the scope um, and started sending rounds right where they should be again with the majority of them over to the right which I later on adjusted again as I, I shot further out but um, this had a pretty decent group going this was a seven round group total uh, four shots all in this cluster here, five, six, and the seven way down there. But, uh, so yeah, that was not too bad. Second group at 100 yards, federal gold medal match, of course. This is probably about an inch and a half, maybe, if even that. Yeah, probably about an inch and a half. Um, I didn't measure these out because I didn't really care to at this point. I know I had better groups, so I'm not going to waste the time with it. Um, second, or third group at 100 yards. That one's a, probably a little better, probably an inch and a quarter maybe, somewhere around there. That was pretty good. And then the fourth group, everything just kind of fell apart. <laughs> this would have been good, but then this one screwed everything up. So it happens. It's, uh, it's life. Um, reaching out to 200 yards, I only shot the gold medal match ammo at 200 yards. Um, point of aim was up here, anticipating about a two inch drop, which made sense. Uh, actually, this was a little more than two inch drop. I guess this would be like three inch drop, but uh, the rounds impacted over here Obviously showing a preference to shooting to the right So I adjusted on the second group, but still that's a pretty awesome group. That's probably inch and three-quarter maybe Somewhere around there at 200 yards with three shots The second group kind of fell apart. I don't know how the heck the target got wet either like I went to go take the target off the backboard and um, It was wet and this came out of nowhere. I don't know what the hell happened here. Uh, I don't know if somebody was slinging lead and a you know a chunk of a bullet came flying and hit my target, or somebody else shot my target for some reason. I don't know. Doesn't quite make any sense to me. But that was not me. These shots were me. A um, little more spread out than the last group, but uh, the windage is proper, a little more proper anyway. So they seem to hit pretty much centered. Uh, again, a little bit more to the right, so I could have probably adjusted another click or two to the uh, left. But regardless, still a pretty decent group. Probably two inches at 200 yards. Not too bad. So that's all I have for today. Didn't want to waste too much ammo, and that place was busy. But um, yeah, they had uh, 50, I think they had 57 or 58 lanes there, and everybody had a bench when I walked in. So I actually had to wait for one. But um, pretty cool, got to spend some time there. Got to send some rounds down range. Still, the targets are nowhere near as good as these here um, from December of last year. This is the PMC X-Tac at 100 yards. And at 200 yards with the PMC X-Tac, two inch group. And then the Federal Gold Medal Match, 100 yards. Outstanding .45 inch group. And then,
at 200 yards of .43. So again, can't really compare to these groups, the shot, the groups that I shot today, but um, the rifle is definitely capable of doing it. I just wasn't quite where I needed to be, I guess. So that's it, and there'll be more stuff coming down the road, but uh, I'll get out shooting again in a couple of weeks.